Hey guys, my name is Stephen Beecham, and here's what's happening this week on CNET's Crave Blog. NASA has a new space launch system which is cleverly named, drumroll please, the NASA Space Launch System. Well, to get everyone pumped up about their new space launch system, aka the SLS for short, NASA produced a short music video showing off the new rocket, which is slated to do some big things in the coming years, including launching a bunch of astronauts to Mars. Check it out. Now you can play the video game that Elon Musk made when he was just 12 years old. The game was called Blastar and is reminiscent of the Atari games being played at the time. Musk sold the game to a PC magazine for $500. The code was recently published in an Elon Musk biography called Elon Musk, Tesla, SpaceX, and the Quest for a Fantastic Future. A Google software engineer named Thomas Lorett made the game into an HTML5 version for anyone to play for free. Check out the Crave blog post for a link to the game. Pornhub is using the power of Indiegogo to raise $3.4 million to shoot a porn in space! The adult film project is called Sexploration and will feature adult film stars Eva Lovia and Johnny Sins. The production will take place on a privately funded space flight. Pornhub plans to train and outfit a small video crew and purchase custom modified film equipment for the historic shoot. We're gonna make porn in space. YouTube weapons builder Styro Pyro recently showed off his 40 watt laser shotgun on his YouTube channel and the results are frightening. The shotgun uses a 40 watt blue diode array that concentrates eight laser beams into a magnifying glass that focuses the beams into one dangerous laser beam, kind of like the Death Star. The diode array is powered by a huge lithium polymer battery pack capable of dumping 250 amps, and the laser array is regulated by a whopping 24 LM317 drivers according to the video description. Styropyro demos the laser by destroying balloons, ping pong balls, and lighting things on fire. Much like every other laser video demonstration, the laser is powerful and hopefully it will not fall into the wrong hands because it can definitely blind or injure someone badly. Check out more of Styro Pyro's videos, including his handheld lightsaber, at youtube.com slash styropyro. This thing is so stupidly powerful, there's really no reason to own one, but I felt like building one anyway. All right, guys, that's the show. Thank you very much for watching. As always, you can find all these news stories at CNET's Crave blog at crave.cnet.com. Make sure you follow Crave on Twitter at Crave. And check out this week's Crave Giveaway. This week's Crave Giveaway is the Tefal OptiGrill Indoor Smart Grill. The OptiGrill has settings for burgers, poultry, sandwiches, sausage, you name it, go to the blog and enter to win.